Alright guys, it's Tachi and welcome back to more post-commentary. Now, I got stuck between episode 20 and 21 where I spent about, I don't know, an hour looking, trying to figure out what to do. So I finally had to go get a guide and uh, I would have never, ever, I don't think I would have ever found the answer to this. But you have to take the mammoth as you can see there. No point weighing myself down. And we're going to take that to the professor as soon as I... Uh, get out of this train here. This train reminds me of Resident Evil. I don't know why. Maybe, maybe Resident Evil Zero. So, uh, are you guys liking uh, the post commentary? Can you tell the difference? It may be something that I try to get used to. I know people like uh, Luxley do post commentary all the time. And Oh, here's the sign I missed. Which we'll be getting into uh, much later. So we have to call that number later. If there's something I forgot. I kind of like these right here, these cuts or whatever I'm doing now. Do excuse me, Professor. Professor. Sorry to disturb you again. Professor, I have brought you something that should be of interest to you. Look. What have you got there, then? Let's see. An effigy of a mammoth. But this is Hans doll, is it not? Yes, of course it is. How on earth did you... Oh, my God. It's in my hands. It exists. It really exists. Please, please do excuse me. I'm, I'm deeply, deeply moved. You see? Your Hans and my Varlberg heir are one and the same. This is incredible. After all these years, how can I ever thank you, my dear? Oh, I must waste no time. I'm, I'm off to my laboratory. I must study this carefully. May I borrow your treasure a moment? Uh, well, actually, uh... Don't worry, miss. I will take the greatest care of it. But I need to study it. You see, it has such importance to me that this very afternoon I shall deliver an impromptu lecture to my students about this very object. If you are interested in Hans Vorlberg, then it is essential that you attend. Hmm? Do you think so? Obviously. Give me your telephone number and I will call you the moment my lecture begins. I will return you your doll at the end. You have my word. So how anybody is supposed to figure this part of the puzzle out, I have no idea. Like, that's the uh, last thing that I would have thought of. So this opens his, uh, opens his, uh, little studio area. Not studio. Oh, crap. What's the word? Uh, laboratory. And I get a, uh, a little coil with a message on it. And there's nothing else to pick up here. But this unlocks uh, a lot of the rest of the game. So as you can see, there's a few items over here. And look at there. I don't need that for the time being. I have being. no idea what that is. But as you can see, I finally get the uh, tongs. Which in fact... I don't need that for the time being. Which in fact being. means we can go get that damn egg for some reason that he couldn't get before. Or she couldn't get before, I'm sorry. What is it you want to know, miss? Nothing. I'll leave you in peace. I just want to see if there's extra I dialogue. hope I haven't disturbed you too much. Sorry? No, 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 not at all. This is where he was making the, uh, the wine at. And we are at the bird. I'm going to use the tongs. And grab the egg. And the egg goes to the uh, bandstand, which we can see me cutting right now. So you put the egg, even out the golden egg, and that lets us get inside this door. Now 
This is actually pretty cool if you take a look, actually stop and take a look at it. It's like a uh, music box, sort of. It's kind of amazing that a, a little kid, I don't say a little kid, but Hans Wahlberg had the mind to make something like that. The gentleman, forgive me for disturbing you again, but I have a little problem. A little problem, a little problem. They are kept to oneself, and they don't stop the work. Nor trains from leaving stations. Gentlemen, I have managed to repair your university bandstand. The bandstand is playing again. This is marvelous news. Yep. We are really very grateful, very grateful indeed. Yes, very grateful indeed. We will look back on your visit with much fondness in our hearts. <laughs> and now let us in turn honor our word. How much is it you need, miss? A hundred dollars, if it's not too much to ask. Something about like this. <clears throat> We agreed to grant you the aforementioned sum, miss. You may now leave with your train. And while we're on the subject, when will you be leaving? Soon. Uh, yes, because now you should relocate your train as quickly as possible. Here we are, busy chat chatting, and look at the clock. It's tea it's time. Tea time. Already? My word, doesn't time fly by? Thank you for a charming visit, Miss. Soon. And thank PM. you, gentlemen. So I give him the money. I like. I really like these new effects that I put in. I mean, uh. There you go. Here's your money. Up from time I checked to time. it. It's Nothing all there. Really crazy or anything. Hundred dollars in coins. Ah, thank you. Not difficult get dollar. <laughs> See, you are a real businesswoman. I'm not the only one around here. <laughs> no kid. We please to do deal with you. Now you open lock, or we no help you. Why didn't you manage to open them? After all, you don't have to be a genius. Ma vor vat pensino sesto, declina madam. No se saye mara ales non comprendo en alora caput en andere bordel. Zirs var moi. On boom telefonieren caput caput. My husband say instructions complicated. No understand manual. My husband angry. Very angry. Oh, now telephone broke. Caput. Now that is annoying. What are you going to do next? We wait, repairman. Well, I don't have the time to wait. I'll have to go have a look. There must be some way of releasing the opening mechanism. Take key. Sailor always need key for lock. So he throws it on the ground. Okay, thanks. Pick up the key, and then I'll probably cut to the, uh, machine. Oh, yeah, I get a phone call in between. Hello? Hey, how's my little baby girl? I was thinking about you only yesterday, because I saw this fantastic fur coat. You are wrapping up warm, aren't you? I mean, people in foreign countries never know how to dress properly for the weather. Mom, it's so sweet of you to worry, but I'm fine, really. The trip's a breeze, no worries. I mean, there's... Well, when are you coming back? Frank is dying to meet you. Frank? Oh, yeah, your singer. 
You two seeing each other then? Oh, you'll never guess the surprise he gave me yesterday. No, I suppose I won't. Frank invited me to a big charity show organized by, oh, uh, well, someone or another. Uh, anyway, they got him singing a couple of old numbers from his repertoire, and in the end, he asked me to go up on stage with him. Can you imagine me, your mother, on stage in front of thousands of people? Wow, I would have loved to have been there. Not too emotional, I hope. Oh, too emotional by far, especially as I hadn't even been to the hairdresser. Well, I didn't even have the proper dress on. But Frank promised me he'd see to that next time. Oh, uh. he's such a cutie. And he's such the sweetest little. <laughs> I'm sure he has, Mom. It would be so good if you could join us one day. Let's see, when is his next gala? I'm so forgetful these days. I swear I'd lose my head if it weren't in the clouds. You just watch out, my girl. Them years will catch up with you much quicker than you think. I'll look out for them, Ma. Nice to hear your voice. Lots of love. Well, to you too, my little munchkin. <laughs> so, it's kind of nice that we get these random phone calls. And here we are at the uh, lock mechanism. The instructions are written in a language I don't recognize. The instructions are written in a language I don't recognize. So we take the look at the phone number right here. And we have to call it. I thought this was a pretty cool puzzle. Welcome to the East Lock Control Center. To start, press the number sign. If you are using the Haltenberg Lock, press 1. If you are using the Morloff Lock, press 2. If you are using the Conning Pass Lock, press 3. If you are using the Barrackstadt Lock, press 4. To return to the last command, press the number sign. If you want to raise the water level, press 1. If you want to lower the water level, press 2. To return to the last command, press the number sign. You want to lower the water level in the Barrackstadt lock? To confirm your choice, press star. To return to the previous command, press the number sign. Your request has been logged. Unfortunately, our regional technician is currently on holiday, and no replacement is available. We will reply to your request within 48 hours. In case of an emergency, please operate the lock system manually. We apologize for delays to our service. So I figure out that you have to use the keypad and then do the uh, the same commands that you entered on the telephone. That, that caught me up. I don't know what I... It's a simple puzzle. I just wasn't completely thinking, right? So, uh, I'll see you next time. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. This is Tachi signing out. Have a good day.